What's up guys, I'm a little behind on this week's video so instead in the meantime I figured I would commentate an old tournament highlight from when I was a blue belt. There's a sneak peek of the new video at the end. I'm doing the right thing here, pulling the arm across to make it easier to get the choke, also holding my own shin to keep the posture broken. I know it's a done deal, for some reason I look at the camera but then I realize and look away. This is an X guard sweep I use all the time, it's my favorite because it's so smooth. It's really dependent on getting the far side sleeve. My opponent easily could have defended this sweep by working to stand up or wrestle me. I look pretty stiff passing here but did kind of like a lag drag and smoothly took his back. Here's a nice double underpass. This guy actually went on to become one of Canada's top competitors in nogi. I'm having trouble getting him flat on his back. As he turns away I find the space to get underneath his hips to take the back. I still do this style of back take all the time. We actually had a rematch scheduled for April 2020, but obviously COVID got in the way. I still want to make a return to competition, but a gym, a YouTube channel, and three kids has me pretty busy. Hopefully one day though, in either Jiu Jitsu or MMA. Baron Bolos were all the rage in 2015. Now they're just a tool in the toolkit. It's the same thing that's happened to leg locks. It's really cool to see the stages and progression of BJJ within my decade of training. I had exactly three years of training at this point. It's funny, the date of the tournament fell exactly on my anniversary of when I started training. He's right, I could have kept my elbow tighter to prevent my opponent's head from popping out underneath my arm and escaping, but luckily it worked out just fine. This is a really cool ankle lock from Xguard. I don't do a ton of ankle locks anymore as I mostly favor the heel hook. I used to do them a lot though, they're a great way to quickly finish a match, especially at the lower belts. This was the same setup as the last ankle lock. Xguard is a very powerful guard for sweeps and leg locks. My next video is on grips. Breaking grips, fighting grips, the importance of grips, and more. In my eyes, it's a game changer. I hope you're as excited about it as I am. Let me know what your favorite highlight was from the video.